Hi guys, this is Mauriz from Cash Game Festival here in Bratislava alongside with my soulmate, Jackson. How you doing, man? Doing great. As no always. No place better than Bratislava to have a Cash Game Festival. At the Banco Casino for the second time this oh. year. Banco Casino. Banco Casino. So, how was the action yesterday? We got some hefty games going on, right? Yeah, it was pretty sick. I mean, the TV table action was great. The side action was yeah, so, great. You know why it was great? Because you were here? Yeah. I, I made poker great again. You did make poker great again. Thank you. And uh, yeah, we had we had tons of side table action. Of course, there was the 50 grand tournament running on the side, which was exactly. very successful. Yeah. And uh, we expect a great five days here in Bratislava. We got players from all over Europe, more or less. Yeah. The crazy Swedes, the crazy UK guys, directly from the airport, started to play. Players from Netherlands, Italy, France. France, France oui, oui. Viva France. We also got uh, a couple of Pokio winners. Yes. Uh, from the raffle we did earlier from our group at the, at the Pokio app. Yeah, Billy was playing already last night. Ville, yeah, Ville Sari from Sweden, actually. And also we got a couple of uh, raffle winners from the Sunny Beach event. Yes. And nice uh, guys. A couple nice. of the other guys came from Sunny Beach, even though they didn't win the raffle because they right, had such a great time at Sunny Beach. Let's look at the highlights from yesterday. Jason, so uh, do we have a pick of the day? Yes, um, there were actually some amazing hands during the PLO stream. Uh, these guys were not afraid to straddle, they were not afraid to gamble. On the very last hand of the feature table, it was straddled up to 32, and keep in mind it's a 2-2 game. Uh, so players had deep stacks, but not all players did. And it was a 5-6-6 board, and Steven just shoves the lot with nothing, no clubs, and uh, just the 7-8. Nobody had a six, nobody had a full house, nobody called, and he took down a nice pot at the end. Who won the table yesterday, the PLO table? Uh, who won the PLO table? I'm actually kind of shocked that that happened. This Frankie that won the PLO table, and he, I don't know. he was down a little bit. We did a flash interview, but then he came back. Uh, it was a sick hand, actually. He was so lucky. He, he got himself involved in an uh, all-in, th three ways all-in with absolute rubbish. And he basically told everyone, I have no outs, nothing at all. Uh, he was up against a uh, flopped top set. And then I think James rivered a uh, top set actually with aces. And they were like, I have set, I have set. And, and Frankie goes, I have a straight. I have a straight. I have a straight. <laughs> you know, so bada bing, bada boom. Yeah. That's he, how he, pillow goes though sometimes. That's how it, they all got Frankified. Frankified. Franco, Frankovich Frankified them. So what's happening today? Today we have a beer bike tour that should be absolutely amazing. I've never been on one, I don't know about you. Can but, you ride uh, a bike? I can ride a bike. And drink beer at the same time? I can ride a bike and I can drink beer. We'll have to see if I can ride a bike and drink beer at the same time. That's a uh, Yeah, I'm not going to ride the bike, I'm just going to drink beer. Drink beer and you, you have to the ride. bike. Or yeah, I'm going to ride the bike and you're going to drink the beer? Something like that. It sounds like I'm getting the short end of that stick. C'est la vie mon ami. Okay. Uh, what else is happening? What else is happening today is that we also have a raffle for our Pokio winner. Uh, so basically anybody that plays 100 hands on, in our Pokio club gets a raffle ticket. We're going to do a live drawing here in the casino. The winner will get a cash game festival Bucharest package at the poker room. Bucharest yes, on correct. October 16th to 20th. So that package is valued at 1,500 euros. Not bad for just playing 100 hands, getting a ticket, getting a chance to uh, to win the lot. Great. That's how friendly and then you know gentle we guys are at the Cash Game Festival. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Also, it's still fun here. They're still playing Cash Game behind Plush, who's running the camera. They uh, they even had breakfast by that's, the table. That's like epic. That they, 24 they had breakfast served at the table. I've heard of taking a break for breakfast. We'll be back in half an hour. Some players come back, some don't, but they had breakfast at the table. Yeah, and they're playing quite uh, normal games, right? Yeah, Three course. boards, three yeah. three, this and that, six-handed suite and whatever. Yeah, I watched one hand where they weren't even sure who won because there was too much going on. So they, it took two minutes to figure out that actually Franke won the hand. Uh, that's unusual. Yeah, Frankified again. Yes. So there's also this uh, cool tournament, right? 
Yes, of course, there's the 50 People can grand still buy in, actually. On. Yeah, today is day 1B. Uh, there's day 1C tomorrow. There's a bunch of opening flights. Yesterday attracted 72 entrants, which yeah. was a pretty good start, hmm. considering it was a Wednesday afternoon, and a lot of players don't like to play the first of opening flights. 14 players survived, and today should even be bigger and better. Yeah, I'm going to be at the final table of that event. Yeah, I heard that you want a satellite. Is this true? It's so easy. I make poker great again all the time. With Queen Deuce. Let's not go into the specifics. <laughs> uh, all right, catch you later on, guys.